Air retrofitted skigs give you the flexibility to adapt your boat for flat or moving water. It's important to carefully lay out your skig patch so that the boat will track correctly. Start out by tying a string between the front and rear D-rings. Lay the template on top of the string. Make sure to line up the notches in the template with the string. Then measure the distance from the stern end of the floor pocket to the edge of the template. For tandem boats, the template should be placed 31 inches from the stern end of the floor pocket. For solo boats, the template should be placed 25 inches from the stern end of the floor pocket. After correctly positioning the template, tape it down to the boat. For the purpose of this video, we are going to use a mock-up instead of a real boat. Remove the string and use a pen to trace the inside of the template onto the boat. Remove the template and align the skeg patch with the trace line. On the bottom of the patch you'll see markings indicating the bow and stern. Make sure to orient the patch correctly. Make small reference marks on the patch and the boat so that it will be easier to line up the patch later. Use masking tape to protect the rest of the boat from glue. You may want to further protect the boat with newspaper. Clean the areas you'll be gluing with denatured alcohol. Scuff the boat with sandpaper, then wipe it with denatured alcohol again. After mixing the catalyst into the Stabond glue, paint a layer of glue onto the prepped boat surface. Scuff the patch with sandpaper and wipe it with denatured alcohol as well. Carefully apply a layer of glue to the patch. Let the glue dry for 20 to 25 minutes, then apply another coat to both the boat and the patch. Let the second coat dry completely so that it is no longer tacky. Lay the patch down on the boat using your reference marks to keep it straight. Pick up one side of the patch and heat the glue on the patch and the boat with the heat gun until it becomes tacky again. Carefully lay down that side of the patch. Now lift the other side of the patch and heat the glue on that side of the patch and the boat with the heat gun until the glue becomes tacky. Lay down that side of the patch. Rub out any bubbles. Use the heat gun to warm the top of the patch. Stop heating it before it becomes too hot to touch comfortably. Remove the masking tape and let the glue cure for 24 hours. With the boat at soft pressure, install the skeg by sliding the front into the bow end pocket. 
then fitting the stern end into its pocket and sliding the skeg back. 